everybody, Katu. Uh, this is your brother, Hussein Abdullah. And I want to tell you a little bit about a continuous charity in their educational justice program. Now, we know higher education is a huge indicator when it comes to uh, when it comes to class and any type of upward mobility or even any type of opportunity uh, here in here in America. And so higher education is a must. We also know that when it comes to uh, tuition and student fees and even loan rates, uh, they are not all made equal. And unfortunately, when it comes to uh, African Americans and other uh, BIPOC peoples of people of color and other communities, um, there's a huge disparity and there's a huge predatory market out there to quite frankly uh, submit and subject some people to what seems like financial slavery. A continuous charity uh, through their educational justice program is looking to alleviate that burden uh, by giving non-interest uh, free loans uh, to students. It's, I mean, it's awesome. Uh, growing up, I wish that this opportunity was there. Well, maybe, I don't know, uh, because for me, paying for school uh, wasn't even in my mind. I was like, I got to get a scholarship or I don't know what I'm going to do. And so there was a lot of pressure on myself to go out and perform. And uh, ultimately, alhamdulillah, I did get a scholarship to Washington State University. But um, that type of pressure is something that everybody shouldn't walk around with. Uh, nor is that type of pressure or stress for an 18, 19, 20 year old to go and just try to better themselves, but they're looking at 10,000, 20,000, 40,000, some cases, $100,000 of debt racking up that they're going to have to, uh, they're going to have to pay off. You know, they're going to have to work themselves out of this hole just for wanting to learn. So please, uh, join me and join a continuous charity and giving the Sadaka Jadia through their educational justice program so we can alleviate uh, the burden of debt for some of our fellow Muslim brothers and sisters. Assalamu alaikum.